Hi, I'm Liz. Today, I will show you the proper technique for using a GLP-1 injector. Newer medications to help treat diabetes, the ones that work with your body to help it release its own insulin, come in a pen with a preset dose and with the needle already attached. Some examples of these pens are Trulicity and Manjaro. Usually the dose is only one day a week. The patient should try to stick to the same day and same time every week. If the patient has missed their weekly dose by more than 72 hours, wait until the next scheduled dose. It's a little bit different than an insulin pen, so I will go over this injection technique. The pen has a base cap, a clear base, a medicine window, lock and unlock icons, an indicator arrow, a lock ring, and a button. To prepare for the injection, you'll need the pen and an alcohol swab. Each box comes with four pens. Keep the pens in the fridge until use. Take the pen out and let it come to room temperature, which takes around 15 minutes. Keep the base cap on the pen until the patient is ready for the injection. Read the label and expiration date to make sure you have the correct medication and that it has not expired. Inspect the medication to make sure it is not cloudy and does not contain particles. If the solution is discolored or contains particles, do not use the pen and get a new one. Wash your hands with soap and water and don gloves. Remove the base cap and throw it away. Hand the pen to the patient. You can inject either in the abdomen or the thigh. It may be necessary to educate the patient to rotate injection sites and to separate sites by at least the width of one index finger. After the injection is complete, advise the patient to throw the pen into the Sharps container. Document the injection site on the medication administration record and change gloves after each patient.